pita mamoe fatia lofa was a Samoan Matai, a chief who heralded from a large, prominent Samoan family. He was a big chief with an even bigger heart. He was a legend, an icon, a leader, and a simple and humble man. He loved his rugby, his family, his mates, his country, and the Samoan people. As most of you are aware, Papali Tele was not only well known for his performance on the rugby field, but also for his sense of humor and for some of his one-line comments. One of his famous one-liners was, anyone can feel free to call me a coconut, but he better be a very good friend. Or the time when a TV and said reporter in Apia said to Fats, quote, how would climbing up that palm tree so we can film it sound to you? To which Fats replied, how would get stuffed sound to you? <laughs> there have been many tributes from all over the world to Palitele since the sad news broke of his sudden passing last week. Many of these tributes referred to some special and memorable moments with Pali Tele. I too have had many of these special and memorable moments with Fats. But one that stood out was the night of our wedding. At three o'clock in the morning, we decided to leave our wedding party to go for our honeymoon. But as we were about to drive off, the back doors of our car opened and Fats and his friend Ken Moala jumped in. They wanted to be dropped off at a party in the middle of a polo island. Of course, it was useless arguing with Fats at that hour of the morning, so we obliged. We got to the venue of the party and Fats got out and told us to wait while he goes in to check. <laughs> Five minutes later, he came back and said the party was finishing off but can we take them to another party? <laughs> By this time, it was almost four o'clock in the morning. I reminded Fats about the time and the fact that we were going for our honeymoon. In the end, he agreed to give the other party a miss, but they wanted to come with us to our hotel. <laughs> Suffice for me to say, that we watched the sun come up with Fats <laughs> and Kane on our wedding night. <laughs> 10 years later, we were quietly celebrating our 10th wedding anniversary at a restu restaurant in Apia when a bottle of champagne arrived and it was from Fats. He remembered our wedding day. <laughs> 